you can create text in Substance Designer using the text node. So I'm going to create a text node. Here I'll just hit the space bar and just choose text. So now I have this new text node. Here at the top, you can see that we have a color mode, and that's color or grayscale. I'm just going to switch this here to color, and I'm going to type in some text. All right, so now that we have some text, uh, let me just adjust my font size. So here I'm just using the font size slider. I also have a font dropdown where I can choose and preview different fonts. All the fonts that you see here are going to be your system fonts. I can also edit text directly here in the 2D view. So here I'm just going to add some more text. Now I also have this transform widget and I can use that to rotate my text as well as scale the text object. Now you'll also notice that as I start to scale this, the text is tiling. Just hit my space bar and you can see that we do have some tiling text here. So I'll go back and just kind of change my uh, font size. I also have the ability to change my alignment. And here I have some numeric entry for this transform widget. So here towards the bottom, we have our font color. So I can go in and change my font color. Now my background is set to black at the moment. And if I wanted to make that transparent, I could do that by just simply uh, taking my alpha slider here and just setting that all the way to zero. You can also link a font to your substance package. So here I'm going to come to my package, uh, right click and choose uh, link and then choose font. And I'm going to grab this Terminator font that I downloaded. So this font is not installed on my system. So now I'm going to create like another text node here. And uh, let's come over here to my font and I'll click my drop down box here. Now any font we've linked to our substance package, you'll find that here at the very top of the font list. So let's select our Terminator font and type in some text. And I'll just change my font size. And so now we can use a font that's been linked instead of something that was already installed on my system. So when you're using a text node and you publish your substance, the font is going to be embedded as a resource within that substance. And this is the same for a resource that we've imported, as I've shown here with this Terminator font, or if we already use a system font. Either way, this font's going to be embedded within the substance package when we create the SBSAR file. So that's all there is to using text here in Substance Designer.